Commission of Inquiry set up to address the February 25th incident in which four out of five divers died after they were sucked into a 30-inch pipeline at Paria Fuel Trading Limited's birth six has reached the investigative stage. The latest development was confirmed by Finance Minister Colm Imbert, who addressed the matter at the House of Representatives on behalf of Minister of Energy and Energy Industries, Stuart Young. Since the commissioners were sworn in, steps have been taken and are being taken to put the administrative infrastructure of the commission in place, including the establishment of the secretariat for the commission to commence its hearings. The commissioners are currently involved in the pre-hearing stage of the inquiry, which is also known as the investigative stage. Minister Imbert added that the investigative stage is one of the most important stages of this matter. During this stage, the relevant evidence is obtained and identified, and the relevant witness statements are prepared. This investigative stage of the inquiry is regarded as the lifeblood of the inquiry and prepares the way forward for the evidential stage of the inquiry. LMCS divers Faisal Kirban, Rishi Nagasar, Yusuf Henry and Kazim Ali Jr. died following the incident at Paria's point pay facility. A fifth diver, Christopher Budram, survived. Former head of Jamaica's Appeal Court, Justice Cecile Dennis Morrison QC, is the chairman of the Commission of Inquiry into the matter.